And I've got the problem, which as it turns out is a big problem. Mira Marathi, she started a business, she's worth $2 billion and six months later, she's produced a research blog. It's, this has <laughs> got, this, she is the female yarn lacoon at this point. <laughs> <laughs> but, but she's, she's at least raised some money. She's at least started something. <laughs> she's gone and done something. She's done herself. something. Come on, yarn. <laughs> I think we had a bit of a laugh that they did that massive raise without a product, but I guess it's, it's kind of gone one step further because they haven't gone and released the product six months later. They've released the problem that they're going to solve. <laughs> it's like, I love it. Okay, we, we got the money. First, we've got to figure out what the problem is. And then finally, they've got the problem, which as it turns out is a big problem. So the problem is we all know that AI, when using LLMs, can hallucinate. It can say different things. And the whole idea of it is it's probabilistic, right? It's got a probable chance of saying this word after the other one and that's how these systems are built so inherently you have this non-deterministic nature which is a fancy way of saying you don't have 100 percent accuracy over the broader result will be if you ask it this, the same question it's not always going to give you the same result which in like typical computing is really scary but we're kind of taking it as a given now as because ai is so good at what it does. We just have to take it as a given that sometimes it's going to be wrong. But what they're saying is they're doing the research and they're going to build a product to make AI deterministic. And I think that's what the world needs.